and welcome to another Team Wild leg stay. Here we have Yo doing 20 to 25 reps on the leg stage. We'll do about three sets of these and we do this to get the legs ready for the other workout areas of exercise I should say. Uh, let's get the legs pumped full of blood and get them ready. Uh, we don't go too heavy on this because we want to protect our knees. Obviously going too heavy on our leg extensions is asking for problems. Hence 20 to 25 reps to get the legs warmed up. And there we go, yeah, looking right now. And next we move on to the leg press. And with this we're doing three sets of around 8 to 12 reps. Uh, we're going for weight over uh, reps and this time it's to really stress the muscle. Uh, this obviously initially is a warm set so it looks like obviously it was doing less but with this workout we did actually go heavier in the end uh, and again it's to hit the quads mainly obviously with the leg press although it does vary depending on the stance if you go for a wider stance it can hit the hams instead of the quads directly uh, so it's it's a variable exercise but as you can see I've gone heavy there with a number of plates myself. Here we have Yo doing the hat squat, and this hits the quads and the hands. Of course though, uh, depending on how you stand as you lift the weight up using your legs, you can hit the quads or the hands more. We tend to go back on the hills a little bit more, and so hit the hands. Once we completed the hacks, we then moved on to the V-squat, and here, this is to hit the quads mainly. As you can see, Yo's quads are popping quite nicely there. And that is, a, it's an exercise designed to just put the weight straight onto the quads and take some of the stress off the spine. It's certainly an area that me and Yo have had problems with in the past, and so it's very good for us. Next, we do the lying ham curl. And again, the reason why we do this, particularly over the standing ham curls and Romanian uh, straight leg deadlifts and the, the kind of thing, is again we have spinal injuries and again we prefer to do movements where the spine is exposed to less stress and this is good for hitting the hands and great for avoiding the spine. As you can see though, yo looking fantastic. Eight weeks out, couldn't be happier. Next, Yo did some sumo squats by herself, just using the dumbbell. She tends to do exercises like this between uh, exercises that I'm doing, simply uh, to put some extra stress onto the hams, onto the quads, depending on where she wants to hit. And again, we do some walking lunges, and again, depending on how deep and how far back you lead, you can hit the quads more, or the hams more, and the glutes. So, she's really hitting it hard, and we're really happy for some good results uh, in the uh, British, well, good results, I should say. And there we are, and here we have Yo just doing a quick little pose down for you, just so you can see how on the 18th of August she was looking in uh, preparation for the British on the 19th of October. So please keep on watching us, and watching Yo and her progress towards the British, as I say, on the 19th of October this year. Thanks for watching, bye bye.